Hello and welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we discuss the biggest entertainment stories. My name is Elsie Godwin, and I've got my very interesting co-anchors with me, Ife Oluwa Oshokaye and Nimi Dekombi. Gang, gang. Mm. Yes, your gang, gang is becoming monotonous. As mm. no do the game. <laughs> gang, gang. <laughs> What's How going are you on? doing? I'm blessed, I'm blessed. Okay, I like your hair actually. You're uh -huh. tempting me, but thank nah, you. I won't fall for it. That's Until the I plan. marry. <laughs> now, moving on to the ah. main story. See, you've left the market too. Ah. Mr. Easy announces a short break from music. If you're wondering what his reasons are, wonder no more. Cold is the reason. That is Hamatan. Mr. Easy shared a photo of himself wearing a short soldier's uniform as he revealed the news of how badly the weather has gotten to him. In the caption of the post, he said, Guys, the cold finally got me. Man, no fit record. So it's vacation time. See you in February. Until then, keep living in an atmosphere of miracle. Signed, Idon Easy. <laughs> I like that um, catchphrase, you don't mm -hmm. easy, because, mm -hmm. yeah, you know, before it was trying to be easy, but now you don't easy. Oh, yeah, okay. So I, I, like didn't, I didn't look at it that way, exactly. but that, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. That yeah that that's way. cool. Mm. So, um, secondly, um, the Amatan just lasted three days, because today it was Has gone. Has it gone? It's it gone! <laughs> like, I mean, I'm so pissed, because... It's, I just uh, see it. Oh, it's actually it. only in Lagos, Sha, because eh? in Ogu State. In Lagos, where? Yeah. Did you see the video from, is it Cardinal or Kanwa? No, yeah. I'm saying it's only in Lagos that it lasted three days. Oh, okay, yeah. Like, I mean, in other Lagos states, is it was... populated, yeah. so, yeah, that's just The Amatan lasted for a very long time. But I still have Amatan, you know, like... No, 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 it's bad. totally gone, because like, I was looking fresh yesterday. Yeah. Please come back, night. Yeah, open my freshness. You were looking fresh yesterday, so, you need so it was the Amata that made you fresh. Yes, Is that what you're Amata to? makes everyone fresh, No, you haven't uh, noticed. Because no, no, well, in case you haven't noticed, I'm fresh all around the year. So. <laughs> we're all fresh I can't, around the year, but I can't the Amata just both. kind of enhances it a bit. Both. Everybody yeah, knows that, that. especially when you step from AC to AC to the Amata, where they know that you get, you actually have. So big shout out to Mr. Easy for this one, but I'm just wondering if, um, it puts out trust songs every, every month. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? I think he's because just making a caption, or maybe he's just saying he won't be slaving out in the studio. Yeah, this, or you know, being making, at shows yeah. and concerts. And he has know, earned it. I'm sure last month, which is a dirty December for everybody, yeah. was a time entertainers were making money. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. he's, he's stashed so up in And I'm happy about right. what he's doing with his Empower music because um, that was where Joe Boy was found. Yeah. And um, he's trying to put a lot of other people on the map, and I'm really yeah. happy about that. So yeah. I think it is deserves a break so yeah. if mr easy decides to go on a break go on vacation with your yeah. boo yeah. make it a vacation yeah vacation <laughs> yeah yes okay what i'll just say about it is that i mean i feel like other artists should learn from him because him taking like a break is like him saying that he doesn't want to put forth ro rubbish he does not want to bring out nonsense music mm. that kind of stuff so i feel like there are some artists that they just feel like oh i have to release music i have to release music i have to release music they should know their body they should know their like the environment or like how their creative space when they are in a creative mood instead of just feeling like okay they have to put out music every single time well like he first said i mean no artist puts out music every every month, every month every or every time. week so um i i understand taking time out yeah. which every creative person definitely she, understands she for themselves really also do. and if you don't yeah. please begin to understand it for yourself but well, moving on to the next story beyonce has been slammed on social media for remaining seated when joaquin phoenix won Best Actor in a Motion Picture at 2020 Golden Globes um, for his role in Joker. Stars like Leonardo DiCaprio, Reese Witherspoon, Ellen DeGeneres, and Rooney Mara could all be seen standing up and cheering for Phoenix as he went on stage to accept the award. Beyonce has been called arrogant, rude, entitled, and disrespectful. My God, I think people are taking this thing like, too seriously. Get out of your feelings. Jesus. Sis was probably tired. She was probably smiling. Like, and then she, she was looking at and maybe her heels you was being tired. And then she was like, she was like oh, let me just sit down. And, and I mean, her not deal. standing does not mean that she does not respect the craft. Yes. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't even take anything away from the fact that Joaquin deserves the award and that his role in um, Joker, Joker was impeccable. So, it doesn't take anything so away from that. So what are we going to talking about people like Kanye West that actually walked up stage to go and tell people like Taylor Swift that you that don't deserve, you don't deserve the award. I mean, they were more disrespectful, disrespectful in, in Hollywood. Thank you very so much. I don't think and 
this is a I think people deal. are just people I think 2020 is a year of feelings like people just come on 2020 just started. <laughs> you cannot just run 2020 no because people feelings. are really you getting in their feelings, feelings. <laughs> <laughs> because I, I don't see anything wrong with Beyonce sitting down it's like me um, being in church mm -hmm. and then I'm tired and then doing praise and, and do worship a lot. and then I want to sit down that because... one is different just say when you're in church and then the pastor comes on the pulpit and you don't feel like standing up the usher has to look at you like they are the devil like you are the devil you don't know how my um, day has been. You don't mm -hmm. know how the previous day has been. You don't yes. even know how my week has been. Yes. Maybe I even struggled no, to even make no, it to that You event. don't even know how I feel at, at that moment. particular point in time. I may be time. feeling sick. I may be feeling whatever way. So I don't think... I think the people um, writing this post are the mm. ones who have the sense of entitlement. Mm. Do you understand? Yeah. Yeah. I've seen, I've seen so many different reactions. <clears throat> Can you have the sense? People said that she's angry because uh, track spirits did not win the Golden Globe. And that's why she's sitting you know down. So people said she, she, she did not want Drag Queen to win. And I was like, oh, why are you guys why making all of this? Why are they not even in the same the category? category? Do you understand? You are not even in the event. You are not at the event. You don't know what happened. You're just making conclusions based on what you can see. And did you see, see her face? I mean, she was smiling. She was, she was smiling. Back she clapped. She clapped. She clapped. What do you want? Do you understand? Like, I don't mean she had a straight face and she was not clapping. And maybe she was frowning. And do you understand? Then maybe we'll say, okay. Maybe she has a straight face. But if has a straight face, it means nothing, though. Because that's no, just Kanye West. Kanye West goes from a smile now to. Exactly. Are you wondering? What is that? Did anybody have no economy? I feel like people should just take a break. People should leave Beyonce alone. And and I feel like this is, this is even like part of the reason why she does not really like doing interviews. Because people always misconstrue whatever it is that she does. People always misunderstand whatever it is that she does. And I'll just say that these um, celebrities, they are human beings. I think there are people who always with remember the that. misconstruing things. I like they just read really really unnecessary meaning into. I think, there's, I think there's a prayer for 2020. Uh, oh, Lord. Please don't let me be misunderstood. Okay. So everybody should be praying that. This is, if, uh, this is 2020. I have to make sure that boot comes in. But yeah. it's time for a break. And when we return, there could be a very large naming ceremony for Cardi B soon. We'll be right back. <laughs> Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child. I they see them every day. <laughs> <laughs> Most times, I worry more about where I'm coming from mm -hmm. and where I am now, wow. and that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like an Alibaba? Alibaba. Oh, <laughs> Plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to die, everybody feeling all right. Still buy. Sometimes I look myself minimal are you. Mm. Akpala music is for mature minded people. I got DM sometimes from Malawi like woo. Thank you for still staying with us. This is Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. American rapper Cardi B is definitely having fun online with her newfound love for Nigeria and Nigerians on Twitter. Cardi B took to the microblogging site Twitter to ask her fans to help pick a Nigerian name, and she had only two options, which are Chioma B and Kadijat. So, um, I mean, the responses to this tweet has been hilarious or have been hilarious. First of all, but... say, Kadija is not even a Yoruba name, is it? Isn't that a Muslim it's a, name? It's a Muslim name. It's a Muslim yeah. name now, so I'm like... Yeah, but then we have a lot of Kadijats <laughs> in That Yoruba, so. maybe. Mm. Maybe that is why she thinks that mm. it's either Chioma, B or Kadijat. But I think she's just having fun. Yeah. And she picked, it, she picked it from the names we already... I mean, we've been mm. calling her Chioma B since yeah. she um, left. And the people have been calling her Kadijat. Yeah, people are... So she just picked the two and it wasn't anything personal or... Yeah. Very deep for her. Well, but yeah, I like that she's that. having fun yeah. with this. She's just having fun, really. I, the, I would just like to say that I don't know why. Out of all of the, you know, the fun and everything, I think like the only person that exports it for me was when 
um, our minister of uh, was I don't even know what she's the minister of Abike Dabri. Uh, she said she when she responded she's in charge of to um, Nigerians, in, Nigerians the in diaspora. She now responded to her and said, "We welcome you with open arms, sister." And I was just confused. As one in charge of the diaspora for Nigeria, mm -hmm. we can't wait to receive you again. Our doors are open, sister. You need to talk. They take, take a walk talk. through the door of return. You need to <laughs> talk or walk through the door of returning by that great and in this crew. No, I think what I think I think what um Abike Dabi is trying to do is to bring tourism like you encourage. No, come on, if you want to encourage tourism, there's they, this is I'm not trying so hard to not to bash Abike. You people are pushing me, but I will resist. <laughs> No, no, no. The this tourism part. She, 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 she there's so many things to push. I mean, even so if you say avenues. you are so less knowledgeable that you don't know what mm -hmm. to do, you could take a cue from Ghana. You could take Ghana. a cue from Kenya. You could take a cue from South Africa. Tell them, please borrow me your blueprint and look and at organize it something and know what that to attract do. people. Attract people. We have too many mm -hmm. things, too many sites in Nigeria. Yeah. In fact, Lagos alone has enough. Each state in Nigeria has a tourist um, location Science that you that can you promote solely. Promote. Solely and make serious money from it. So this is so not promoting this is not tourism. The, this is not the route in any that she way. Take and at all. I don't know what she wanted to do. Maybe so she was she, just having fun. I think also. she was also just having yeah, fun. maybe. She had maybe she's also allowed to maybe, have fun. Maybe, but uh, my concern is that there are a lot of people in the diaspora that um, need mm. attention, that need your retweets, that need mm. your replies, that, that need that your responses. But to be fair, she's to be fair, she's she's she's, she's been doing, yeah, she's been responding. She's been doing a lot. She can do better. Uh, she can do better, and then she cannot be the only one fighting yeah. this battle. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's it's more like when you know the things are wrong in different angles of the society yeah. or a, different angles of okay. a, so let's a move ministry, on. and you decide to just pick one, and just one person is fighting yeah. that cause, and the other ones will keep pulling it yeah. down. It makes it makes it seem like you're not doing anything. Yeah. So I feel like she's been she responding and she's been doing okay, a lot. Okay, so let's and let's go back to this our naming ceremony. So on this table, uh, what name? Should we give her? She's definitely because Choma B. I mean, we are used to Choma B already. Come on, please. Ah. Kadija is sweeter. See, even your back on Twitter are saying, just go with your Choma B. Choma B. What is Choma B? Uh-uh. Choma B. Uh -uh. B. Choma B. Mm. There's already Kadi B. So the B is Kadi we are changing. It's Kadija. just Kadija. Choma. Kadija. Did you see the one where, I think Kadija. it was a Kenyan or something, that said, well, don't you like this name? And somebody <laughs> said... <laughs> You too. Does this name sound good to you? That should you come to their country the instead. between Nigerians and Ghanaians. No, that, 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 let's just see. Sleep. I think saying Kenya is about like, in this particular context. Yeah. If you're saying the battle is between Nigerians and Ghanaians, then yeah. it's kind of you're kind of insulting Nigerians because at the end of the day, we've oh. seen it play out. In this case, so yes, Nigerians. Can it be lost Nigerians? So let's just yeah. let's just let it go. And to be let's honest, even it. even with the fact that even after she left, like when she was in Nigeria, she was tweeting all of this, and I thought that oh, it's Will end here. Mm -hmm. But even after she went back, mm -hmm. she, yeah, she, she put a video on her story. She was singing that. The only I can't thing she kill said myself. About Ghana, and... about Ghana is that they don't know it's lit. That's, That's the only thing she said. But like even afterwards, she has like been tweeting about Nigeria, and I, I really like and that. And even when the whole um, Iran and the yeah, the US World War Three, I think she's in was trend. Yeah. I mean, when you see the energy that mm. Nigerians have Has. on social media, yes. like we have the highest number of mm. um, population yeah. on the well, internet the from Africa, Africa yeah, right? Yeah, so honest. she's smart enough so, to tap into that market. I mean, yes. if if Cardi B releases a song now, the amount there of money she will make Nigerians for, that will download for streaming it. from yeah. Nigeria. Nigeria in low is going just, to increase. I, 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 I just have a feeling yeah, that so the smart. next track she's going to drop is going to be something Afrobeat. Yes, and probably with an African with an African artist. Maybe with uh, Nigerian. Do. They have a song. They, they actually yeah, have a they song, have no but they've not released. But yeah, she said the problem was with her management yeah. or something. Mm -hmm. So I don't think so they will release it. Anyways, let's move on to the next one. Nigerian um, Nigerian comedian Real Wari Pekin says she attempted suicide 18 months ago. She shared she shared this on Instagram in an attempt to motivate others. In a post she tagged Monday Morning Motivation, which was yesterday, she said, and I quote, 18 months ago, I naked. I gave up. I fall, enter depression, even enter suicide. Now I know better. My life soft like breasts two seconds. It does not take time. It takes God.
God, take one day at a time, do the one your power reach, focus like death. That's your problem, that stepping stone. I wish I could say it in her voice, in her voice but I tried, <laughs> I tried, and just speak the lessons. Yeah. yeah, I think that this is um, very good, and I wish that more celebrities can do more of this, do more of mental health um, advocates, um, like um, um, Corede Bello. Corede Bello is a mental health advocate. I feel like more people need to talk about these things. Depression and suicide is real, and it does not just affect people who are poor, because people always have this mentality that, oh, you are rich, or you are well-to-do, you, you are a celebrity, you cannot be depressed or you cannot be suicidal this thing can affect anybody and mm -hmm. we need to start educating people because ignorance is what would kill a lot of people we yeah. need to start educating people and when i say educating people people still look at when we talk about like depression and suicide people still look at it from the part of oh it's a demonic attack it's um oh just go to church it's because you're broke yeah you know, or, or, you know people I just try to just trivialize it broke you see people just quiet. try to trivialize it but people need to realize that it is a sickness and people need to like go and see a doctor so that they can get like proper treatment. So um, I would say that um, people should keep talking about you know depression and suicide and, they and share their experiences. Yeah, keep sharing their experiences so that people know that they are not alone and they can seek help when they need it. Okay, so um, I'm happy for the real worry begin because yeah. we all saw how she started, so mm -hmm. we can tell that okay before she knows soft like breast. <laughs> okay. So all of a sudden, I can't relate. Uh, but all of a sudden now she's um, looking good. She's yeah. um, you can actually tell that she's getting endorsement deals. She's yeah. um, performing things are looking up for shows. Her. Things are actually looking up. So I understand what it means when you're putting a lot of work into your craft and mm -hmm. you're not yeah. being appreciated or you're not getting the revenue that you, that deserve. you, you deserve. feel like you deserve at that moment. So yeah. it's enough to drive anyone crazy, and especially when that is what you know how to do best. Mm -hmm. You understand? So. Um, I can relate to everything she just said, and yeah. I'm just happy that she's in a better place right now because not a lot of people can overcome yeah. that phase mm -hmm. because it's all a phase. I think we've all been there at one point or the other. Mm -hmm. Well, I've never thought about taking my life. I love life too much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now you see, say we have all been there. <laughs> no, 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 I said we've all been there where we've been down and out, yeah, where we've been we've depressed, but okay. I've not been in a place where I've thought about taking yeah, my I think, life. I think there's a difference. There's depression. Like clinical depression, where you are like diagnosed, and you have to take okay. meds. Okay, I, I really want to know: is there a difference there when you pray that can I just die? Like, can I just sleep and not wake up? Have you done that? Wait now, uh, and when you're actually suicidal. Suicidal are is when you attempt. Attempt, right? When you actually, but when no, you no, no, actually, no, it's not even until you attempt. It's the thoughts. It the comes thoughts. Oh, if they are frequent, if a person is having this thought you just like, mentioned. Yeah, yeah like can I just, is, can I just sleep and not wake up? Like, yeah, so yeah, that, it's something that has to be checked. Yeah, being suicidal. Like you're, yeah. you're, if you're, you're basically like giving that, up. I no no not even I love life too much, darling. Well, we'll go on a quick break. But for those Ankara lovers out there, the slay mamas and papas who like to add a touch of Ankara to every style. Afrique Classic has got you covered. From bangles to earrings, bags, purses, and so much more, even through pillows and sneakers. Get your Ankara fashion and house and house gold accessories and gift items from Afrique Classic. That's A-F-R-I-C-L-A-S-S-I-K-C -S -S on Instagram. Stay tuned, we'll be right back. Welcome to Tea Time on Plus TV Africa, where we bring you the biggest entertainment stories and, of course, analyze them for you. You can have both parents and still end up as a useless child. I just see them every day. <laughs> <laughs> Most times, I worry more about where I'm coming from mm -hmm. and where I am now, wow. and that determines my next step. Why are you sounding like an Alibaba? Alibaba. <laughs> <laughs> Plus TV Africa, we're feeling good. No time to dull, everybody feeling all right. Still buy. Sometimes I look myself minimal are you. Mm. Akpala music is for mature-minded people. Like I got DM sometimes from Malawi, like, woo! Sleeping <laughs> 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 early. <laughs> Kim 
and Chloe Kardashian are mad at um, critics accusing them of not donating to Australia wildfires. Kim replies to one critic saying, nothing gets me more heated than to see people think they know what we donated to and to think we have to publicize everything. Chloe later jumped into the conversation saying, when you do your merciful deeds, do not sound a trumpet before you as the hypocrites do in the synagogues and in the streets so that they may have glory from men. Truly, I say to you, they have their rewards, end of quote. She went on to say, good deeds should be done with intention and not for attention. We are all blessed to be able to bless others, even if it is in the slightest way. But we do not need to be boastful about that. Be boastful in regards to teaching others how they may be able to help as well, end of quote. And... <laughs> I feel like this was so deep and Christian-y yeah. coming from Chloe but then I, no, and Kim. I and I feel like Kanye is rubbing off. No, this is Prince not Kanye's effect. Prince. effect. Who's I want, I want one um, Chloe's, there one, there's a Chloe reality show that she does that she helps people like lose weight and stuff. Um, body, like, body something. Yeah. So like there was one episode that I watched and she was actually very, very deep mm. in that episode. She was, that's I'm like, I'm not even surprised by what she even said. She was very, very deep in that, in that Being episode. Deep is different from quoting by and she but no, she no, no, she you know, spoke I can from, like, still defend myself in that deep because that is a scripted show. I'm sorry. Oh, okay, so right, it could so be a script that was written yeah. for her and said yeah. this makes sense. But this is a tweet that she probably responded. But then who, who yeah. says but then there's, there's no management behind you know? the tweet? It's still impressive. But, but it is impressive. People should, like I said, like you said, this is a year of people being in their feelings and mm. people just jumping on everything that celebrities do and like feeling like and they the have to have opinions. The people attacking them, how much have you dropped? It's not about how much you have if everybody decides to drop a dollar mm -hmm. just one dollar do you know yes. how how long yeah. that will go yeah, so you mean. cannot expect if they decide not to to donate in this um australian wildfire they've done so much you can cut them some slack like yeah. for the copy that's... foundation i'm sorry i have to say it we're only three people in the world that donated to the copy foundation <sighs> myself for ted dollar and dangote oh you my understand? god but i didn't we need copy to come and to come back and that up because i'll be sure you actually donated it. i mean uh, didn't i send the screen grab to the group uh, yeah, which you, guys, you guys saw it now which you guys grab? saw it you saw it right but people need to take a chill pill yes, stop exactly. getting in your feelings like mm -hmm. if it has rightly said and let people leave i mean i'm hoping that we even get to a point in this part of the world let's leave australia and i mean before i move on to that fire is just really scary i was watching mm -hmm. the whole and it's still on and it's they're saying they don't on. even know and when, when it is going to stop early. you see a they've lot lost about 24 everywhere. lives or thereabouts mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, my heart goes out to them dead. and all that yeah the it's animal too is really yes. making them unhappy mm -hmm. okay Back to my country. <laughs> so we've had so many things go on in Nigeria. Yes. Maybe not in Lagos, but in the Northeast, yeah. in um, people that are suffering from whatever the Boko Haram has done, yes. or those traveling and they were stopped by stopped by what they call them at the time, headsmen yeah. and mm -hmm. all that. And I've, I've not seen any yeah, of our celebrities or anybody decide to yeah, stand yeah. up and say, we are raising funds for these people. The only people that show that the body are those that probably already have NGOs, NGOs and they stand up and go yeah. source for funds, yeah. go there, get grants. If grants not even from Nigeria here, yes. outside Nigeria, to help these victims. So I'll be happy the day we begin to cultivate this culture to In say, Nigeria. okay, there is a there is a gas explosion or something mm -hmm. somewhere. Can we come together? Because I think we need this community love more than this people who even practice it because they yeah. have a system that would still cater would to still these cater people them, at the end yeah. of the day mm -hmm. but they still come together to donate so i'm hoping that we can be better as influencers yeah. that we are because at the end of the day these people yeah. are people who influence um, yeah. cultures and lifestyles in society yeah. so please influence better things and learn from don't just learn the sagging and the smoking yeah. and drug and then when we try yeah. to um, mm -hmm. um criticize your lyrics yeah. you say the people you are listening to Come and on. people we are following yeah. they are doing this can you learn their lifestyle also can you learn their char charitable um, way of life also yeah. it will help I think us it's, all. it's a call to nigerian celebrities to do more to realize the kind of platform that they have they mm -hmm. have a huge 
huge amount of followers, they have a huge amount of following, they can, they can make an impact in the society. It's time for them to actually rise up and start looking around at what they can use their platform to do. I mean, the people that are not giving Kim Kardashian and Khloe Kardashian, you know, some slack, they are even speaking up mm. about, you know, this is, there are some mm. of your favorites, some of your favorites, I've never said anything mm -hmm. about, you know, the Australian fans, but they are speaking up, they are using their platform to make people aware that this is what is going on, please mm. donate towards this cause, this is what you can do, this is what you can do. There's some people that don't even care. Mm -hmm. They don't... They don't care. People These people are, are even using their platform. Their they are not donating. Sick. They are not. Mm. Do you understand? So I feel like um, you need to be a brother. Well, exactly. I think on that note, the only thing I'm going to say is that and. In 2020, please let's stop this fake foundations campaign that you people are doing. Mm. That's all I'm going to say. On this Why thing. is your voice going mm. when you're saying that? One? Open, so that's okay. Like, uh, well, spill some tea. I'm just saying, fake if, foundation. before people get to their feelings, you know. Are you talking about in Nigeria? Yes. Oh, yeah, there, mm. there are a lot of fake, fake foundations. Fake foundations in and then it's all Even the fake NGOs. For you to just make money to. And live la vida loca. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. please, let's stop that. And when you start a foundation, make sure it's actually for, for the, the course people, you started for the it for. Course that you started mm. Yeah, so I think I that's think how that's, it goes. That's... Okay, that's how we wrap up this episode of Tea Time. Thank you so much for watching. And remember, you can catch up on all our conversations by subscribing to our YouTube channel, Applause TV Africa. You can also watch your time in on Auto TV and in London on Ben Television. My thank you as always, as always, will go to my co-anchors Nimi Adekombi and Ifeolu Oshokaye, and of course the entire production team. My name is Elsie Godwin saying thank you for watching and be good.